to worry about entering or worrying about doing well. So right now we got the Smash House Boys versus XX versus K9. And off stream we got Ouija versus Bane, a PC kill. But first on this match we go on to Omega Smashville. I dislike this stage because it's Omega Smashville. Just keep it regular Smashville. That's just my own personal thoughts. But right now, XX trying to get K9 off stage. He's in the big corner. He's on the ledge, what's up, dude? Right now, X K9 hasn't been able to get any good trees on him. Right, there we go. What can we get? Alright, now make Fox his life the living, you know what? Alright, still isn't even make any of the game. No one's really committed to anything hard. Ooh, that was a very missed bouncing fish, which is sort of ugly to look at. Missed bouncing fishes are always ugly to look at when they land on stage. All, All right, right. Well, Fox died. Now he'll live. We got Fox Sheet, K9 XX, as as you know, it's a common matchup in the game. Sadly, Fox does lose this matchup pretty badly. But XX doing a really good job. Nice tech of playing the matchup right. Uh, he's not being too greedy. He's not trying to punish Sheik's lagless fair. That was greedy right there. That was a little greedy, yeah. Don't Ooh, die. Is he gonna air dodge? And he died. I don't I respect his air dodge though because down throw up is actually guaranteed <laughs> most of the time on Fox. Even if you spam jump. Okay. And the good thing about Fox uh, when he plays against Sheik is that he can kill her early, but that's pretty much it. He can also combo her pretty well. But everything else, uh, Sheik wins. Mostly. But it's definitely not un like impossible. So let's see what XX can do. Uh, K9 doing a really good job of playing defensive, playing safe, making sure he doesn't uh, overcommit to anything, get hit by fought one of Fox's up tilts, because one up tilt to Sheik is like major damage. I don't know what that is. <laughs> so basically, as long as K9 keeps his defense up, this yeah. match will slowly go away. This match slowly. XX probably looking for right now for a double tip or double jab or uh, just a simple punish, even though it's really difficult to punish. Ooh. That was, he had an opportunity. I don't know about that down smash. Ooh. And, oh, okay. good forward throw. The most, one of the most important parts of this matchup is to keep stage control. Good ledge drop. And okay. Good stuff, good stuff. No options. None. Grab the ledge, down smash. Go on the stage, up smash. All right. So XX definitely down by quite a bit. But Fox is definitely capable of bringing the percent back. One dash attack at like at like five percent. I don't know about zero. She can probably sh shield it. Ooh, that ain't gonna that won't kill. But K9 trying to take his JB. Wow, yeah, good stuff. JB. Free patch. <laughs> All right, K9's up one. Let's see. You think XX is gonna switch to Mario? Since this is semis and there's two games, he might stick with Fox. If that doesn't work out, then he'll probably go for yeah. Mario. Because Mario definitely has an uh, easier time with the matchup. It's not in his favor by any means, but it's better than Fox. Street. But I think XX knows that, you know, K9 plays Zenyu all the time, and Zenyu's Mario is, like, the best in, in maybe even the country. So One of those I think sticking with Fox is definitely... One of those innovative Mario. Yeah. Show. Okay, good jab. That's a really important part of this matchup, too. Uh, Fox with jab. Really, I would be talking about the matchup for Sheik, but it's pretty straightforward. Just grab Fox and hit him. <laughs> and by that, that I mean... Excellent. Ooh, okay, good stuff, good stuff. It was a really good call out on the jump. I, he didn't get. He only got one up air, but that's good enough, because Fox's up air is like, does 16%, so... Okay. okay. He's reading when k on the shield. Yeah. You need to know when... Uh... Ooh, good Tomahawk, nice. Like, right there, he's always... All this damage has come from me every time he's shielded. Ooh, good stuff! He lands with his lag. This goes back to what I said about these bouncing fishes. A wow. bouncing fish on stage and it doesn't hit, it's an ugly bouncing fish. Yeah. Might as well just call that the magic heart. I don't know about XX going for dash tag at this percent. Maybe if he can hit towards it, he can jab. But other than that, it's pretty unsafe. Ooh. Uh, okay, okay, there we go. Oh, I like Kenan to charge needles in that situation. Yeah. Still trying to go in. I feel like Kena is using needles enough because uh, that's a huge factor to how Fox can approach against Sheik if she just uh, stays with needles, stays back. Because with Fox approaches against Sheik, he like it's 20 times worse for him. But, uh, I feel like he should up tilt it there, but the grab is all right too. Good jab. 
Let's see what he can get off his tech chase. Nothing. Oh, Good F smash. Wow. Bach. <laughs> oh. That was a trade we will take all day. He got the sweet spot up smash. Wow. Oh, he's doing really impressive stuff. Okay. Uh oh, here it, it begins. Oh, I, okay. I don't know about that. <gasps> capitalized. I'm Loves pretty sure that was already guaranteed, but. All right, Keon can do grabs. Yeah. A few, a few, a few. You. Oh, okay, good stuff. Yeah. So Keon wasn't ready for that dash attack. Keon was not ready at all. Okay, good stuff from XX. Played the matchup really well. Missed like one important punish, but still worked out for him in the end. He's fine. Good, good stuff all around. He punished everything he, he could. His the bouncing fish. He made sure to. Uh, he called out. Uh, jumps and stuff so he can build up damage because that's pretty much the only way Fox can get uh, damage on Cheek is if he calls something out, calls out a short hop, calls out a double jump and air dodge, or just gets a dash attack or something, up tilt and stuff like that. Ooh, okay, good Chad. Oh, okay. He's trying to go for something a little bit more. I can see why he went for that. I think that might have been a misinput going for an F tilt, but man. Oh, good, he called out the jump. Good ledge drop. Ledge drop. X -X is one of the few Foxes I see that implements ledge drops a lot. Him and him and uh, Grim Turtle. But yeah. Better get back and save. Wow. Okay, landing on the platforms. Nice and safe. And the rage uh, she gives Fox actually helps Fox uh, quite a bit. Ooh, I think that might have been also big enough to. I make that mistake sometimes where I don't tilt the control stick all the way, and it doesn't turn into a jab. But okay. Wow. I feel like ooh, XX is, should, yeah, there we go. Punishing, she should be punishing with grabs more at, uh, because K9's obviously playing really defensive and it's harder for him to get hit. Okay, good stuff. But there we go, it's XX abusing stage control. That's what you need to do against this matchup and, okay. All right, Try that situation, you could just charge more needles. That would have been kind of neat, but. I don't think she could have punished even though it was yeah. far away. Yeah. I would have, that would have been, that was actually a good call out by XX. Drop smash. Oh, nice! Hits the sour spot, but doesn't kill just oh, yet. Some food. That has a sour spot. Yep. It actually reaches under the ledge. If she can be holding on and he just charges it and she stays holding on, she's gonna get hit by the sour spot. Ooh, okay, good. Good job not air dodging. It's a really good 50 50 on Fox. Is he gonna go for the up air? <gasps> Did he just perfect pivot back? Good Stuck. Wow. Yeah, I thought Kano was going to bounce the fish out of there. But really impressive. Easy. Really impressive. Oh! He did a really good job mixing up his recovery, but K9 got it anyway. And he makes okay. it back. Okay, Magnet. Yeah. yeah, Fox can make it back from almost anywhere. At this, if he doesn't get hit. Wow. Wow. I. Wow. That. I think that actually traded with the hitbox instead of. Yeah, he hit the invincible part. That's why. Yeah. No, he, no, he didn't hit it. There is no invincible part. He hit a part where uh, it hit, he hit the. It pretty much clanged with the hitbox. You know when uh, two jabs hit each other at the same time. That happened pretty much. Okay. Okay, good. Okay. All right, the mass jump. That was good. Good luck, Trump. What's he? Oh, okay. Nice pivot grab. He knew that Kanan was sitting shield. Hey, he's just beating stuff from Kanan. Okay, that's the big step. Here comes the damage. That's one thing I haven't seen Kanan really do in this matchup. New jab. This, the jab, in Fox's jab, his new jab, yeah, helps him a lot in this matchup. That's why I prefer it over, oh my. Okay, nice recovery. And Fox, on, on paper, Fox should never be able to make it back on the stage in this matchup. The Fox has to mix, uh, mix up his recovery so much. And Kanan, of course, being really good at, oh. oh too hard. But Kanan can still use his jab more in this matchup. He yeah. Hasn't really used any. His jab, jab, grab works really well. Okay, nice jab. I haven't seen uh, XX go for any of the double, for Fox's double jab yet. Not the one that was patched up, but the tipper double jab, the one that leads into dash tag and up tilt and up smash. He probably isn't confident in landing it, so yeah, yeah. probably. Maybe he hasn't practiced it, or he just eh, is thinking about it. Okay, careful. Dangerous situation on the platform. All right, just I think he might have been looking for a down air there because he doubled. Oh, good call out on the side B. He still lives. I don't think he can make it back from there. No. Of 
game three. I feel like even though I feel like even though it was a big risk, he should have side beat there, because Uppy wouldn't have been able to recover. Even if he took it, even if he took a hit, it's better than just. I don't know. Well, I ain't gonna question you on Fox Game, because you made that character. I don't, I don't touch that character. <laughs> All right, taking him Dreamlight. This is a really good choice for XX because it's a low ceiling. Uh, I don't know about pe people telling me that the platforms are higher. I don't. Maybe the top one, but these two down here are only slightly higher because when Fox does a down air on him, they, it still auto cancels just like it is, does on Battlefield. So I think the ceiling is lower. But I don't know. I'm no expert when it comes to platform lengths. No mistake. That could have been an up air. He could have. Whatever. He got. He was put in a good situation by it, and now he's getting hit. All right, Kieran's going a little more offensive. Than this yeah. Okay, holding the jab, nice mind games, and of course the fair beats it out. What do you, what did you people expect? I'm not expecting him to throw a needle, but that's me. Uh -huh. Okay, good. Ooh, good stuff. Mix it up with side B. That's actually something that's really underused in this matchup. The side B, I don't even use it that much. The side B is actually really good for catching cheeks off guard, and if and if they're at high percent and they get knocked towards Fox, it's a guaranteed up air, and it can kill. Okay. Good the call out with the F smash. smash. Wow. I didn't think it would hit that hard. I'm actually very surprised that hit. Good stuff from XX. With the super smarts on the character. Okay. K9 needs to find a way to take the stock as soon as possible because this is the one position she does not like. And she's not ahead. <laughs> she needs the kill. That's the grab. Uh, probably a misinput on XX's part. part. At this point, okay, up tilt. Big that damage. Hit nothing and she got hit. I feel like XX going for there on the platform isn't as safe as going for a uh, short hop up air. Yeah, but but he's probably going for something that I don't know about, maybe. Oh, Wispy! Okay. <gasps> that was if the he boat. gets hit. <gasps> oh my god! He called it out. He's like, you're getting a bouncing fish to the right. Cannon was like, okay. And he got him. Very impressive by XX. Okay, I need to just shake this off. It's just one Showing of this matchup is not undoable. Sorry, I interrupted you. <laughs> yeah, Kayon just needs to shake this off. It's like, I'm pretty sure you had matches where you won the first match, then someone wins on their counter pick, two stock, you pretty badly. At that point, you either have two options. You can either get frustrated, go in all crazy, crazy, jumbled up, yeah. or you can calm down, recuperate. Think about what you did wrong, and then improve on that. It's a good choice for K9. Also, uh, Fox does gain some stuff off this stage, but it's a big stage, so Fox can't do as much damage to Sheik on this stage because she can just kind of run away and throw needles. All right. Both Ooh. people didn't know which side they're on. I feel like K9 needs to play a little bit more defensive against XX because he keeps throwing on stuff and he keeps getting hit for it. Because if Sheik if Sheik plays offense, uh, defensive with so with uh, like he should play bleh. <laughs> he should play defensive and look for opportunities to. Punish XX because Fox's moves are a lot more laggy than Sheik's. Ooh, okay. Didn't Ooh, tech K9 that. Got scared right there. Oh my gosh! Called it out. Very impressive. Ooh, up tilt shield, and it's gonna be a hefty punish. Good tech away. Finally a jab. A jab. It's about time. That's okay. Easy. Good spot dodge Finally, from XX. You're using <laughs> <jabs. Thank> you. <laughs> really good, play, well placed jabs. This is a game five situation. Even percent, but we all know. Yeah, won't kill, but Fox. Fox can definitely kill Sheik a lot earlier. Okay, good bet. Try to call the jump again. He got the call up, but didn't quite get the up there. Okay, right. I didn't throw anything out on that empty hop. This is where he needs to abuse stage control, try to get as much damage as he can. Maybe even a kill or a read off the one for the F smash. All right, Kanye trying to reset the situation. Yeah, I feel like K9 has caught on to the F smashes at the ledge. That's the thing, Kanan will take these grabs because it's not yeah. dead. That was really unsafe bouncing fish right there. Oh, Fox. Uh, X-Ax did. Ooh, nice nair. Nice space forward here. That was okay. No air dodge. No air I didn't like that. I feel like he should just want to be up there. Yeah, I agree. Okay. Oh, and Dang, he, just, he just he just does it. And it, and it, and wow. It Okay, XX. I, I am watching and I'm learning. <laughs> I would have got hit by that. I wouldn't think that would hit. And I wouldn't have bothered shielding. Ooh, okay, good fair. He has to go deep for it, but Fox is still alive. I'm surprised. Oh, oh no. And yep. Sheik is in a really bad position now because if the percent goes any higher, he can't hit down through upper on him. He got it. 
Okay, 10% extra credit, even though that's not that big of a deal, I guess. Okay, good grab. Before he lost that stock, did Bach do anything, or was that guaranteed? Uh, which one? What? When K9 got the down here. I mean, the down to up That was definitely... If he didn't air dodge, that was guaranteed. If you try to jump out of that, it won't... You can't. Okay. Bad situation. No! Pineapple. Just how oh quickly it just as I said, Fox offstage against Sheik is a nightmare. It's a nightmare. Wow, really unfortunate. Really good stuff to both players. K9 taking his opportunity and gimping XX. Uh, XX did really well playing the matchup right and showing that he understands the character, both characters. Uh, yeah. Wow. Was very but I missed it. What led to that whole entire situation? Because how did XX end up in that situation anyways? I honestly don't remember. <laughs> Dang. I, was he hit off stage or? That's what I'm asking you because I missed that part. I honestly don't remember. But all I know is the second Fox goes off stage against Sheik, it is, it is a nightmare. The poor Fox just gets hit and hit. She can just go off stage. All right, is this most likely gonna be Void versus K9? The run back. <laughs> the run back from Fire and Dice. The 24-hour run back. Oh wait, no, that's not 24 hours. 48 hours.